Uh, what do I what do I talk about in these things? I don't even remember. You don't talk about anything. You talk about random shit. Well, yeah, that's something. <laughs> Me and Nova did a puzzle today. It was very it was very entertaining. It was a whole hundred and fifty pieces. Very challenging puzzle. <laughs> Sad. Yeah, Nova's leaving me. Again, I recommend talking about me. You would be here for hours and how amazing. <laughs> She's really fabulous. She's a fabulous girl. She's leaving me though. She's going back to Pennsylvania. The coolest place on earth. <laughs> um, yeah. It's gonna be lonely for like about a week until you come bad at doing my eyebrows so I think I might just leave them until I can go home and get someone to do them for me even though they look like a Sasquatch's eyebrows I mean sure it's pretty easy to do well I suck at it so last time I did it I gave myself this bald patch right here <laughs> right right there that's supposed to have eyebrow doesn't anymore I don't trust me I'm not trustworthy Ugh, never mind, you're boring. I have an important email that I have to write, uh, but I'm currently putting it off because writing emails is hard. It's so scary. Making yourself seem like you're cool and like worthy of anything is really difficult. It's so much easier to be a self-deprecating piece of shit than to like say why you have any worth as a human. For me, I don't know if other people feel that way, but it's always just, it's so much easier to just be like, ah, oh, yeah, whatever, I suck, than to like actually think about why you don't suck and why you like deserve something. That's so much more difficult. But no one's ever gonna hire me if I'm just like, oh, I'm a piece of shit, no one's... So, I have to come up with reasons why I'm an asset. Anyway, you're right, I did forget to sign off last video, which was super weird. I, I pointed that out, but then you're like, nah, it's okay. <laughs> I'm too lazy. Catch you on the flip side.